This one, just think of somebody who's hyper, got a lot of energy, they're going to be losing weight, their heart's going to be beating fast, uh, over 100 per minute, so that's tachycardia. Increased appetite, nervous, anxiety, uh, irritable, tremors, sweaty, the menstrual periods or patterns are going to be altered. Increased sensitivity to heat, changes in bowel patterns, especially more frequent bowel movements. Enlarged thyroid gland, which is the goiter, uh, which may appear as swelling at the base of the neck. Fatigue, muscle weakness, difficulty sleeping, skin thinning, fine brittle hair. Again, just like with hypothyroidism, all that's kind of boring. Um, if you make a story out of it, it's a little bit uh, easier to remember. So for hyperthyroidism, again, I think of somebody who's playing basketball. They're outside, the sun's, you know, there. Uh, beating down on them. It's really hot. So um, again, they're sweating a whole bunch. So they're losing weight. Uh, they're running back and forth. So that's the tachycardia, more than 100 beats per minute. Uh, their increased appetite. You know, the day before, they knew they were going to have this game. It's kind of like a tournament. So they knew they were going to have this game and they loaded up on carbs, which is, you know, like pasta. The only problem is this pasta was healthy pasta. It had a, it's brown. It had a lot of fiber in it. This is a really expensive uh, pasta. And because it has a lot of fiber in it, the bowel patterns have been altered. So now, man, this guy's got to go, and he's got to go now. He doesn't care if he wins or loses. He just wants the game to finish. Um, he's really nervous. You know, he doesn't want to have an accident on the court. Uh, so now his anxiety is going up, um, and he's becoming irritable because, you know, it's the game's not going anywhere. No one's making a shot. So uh, there's also tremors. With tremors, that's the hands and the fingers. Um, he's kind of afraid to get the ball because if he does, his hands are shaking so bad that he might, you know, miss. And he wants some of his teammates to score the points so they can get out of there. It's really hot outside, so increased sensitivity to heat. And because of all the sweating and, you know, running back and forth, uh, his fatigue, muscle weakness, and anybody who's hyper has a really hard time to go to sleep. So uh, just like if you were to exercise before going to bed, you're going to have a hard time going to sleep. Same thing with the hyperthyroidism. It's like you're constantly exercising. So difficulty sleeping. Th uh, the skin is thinning. I kind of think of this as... You're losing weight, so your fat's, you know, getting thin. And because you're losing weight, your skin is also getting thin. So, fine, brittle hair. Really don't know what to, how to remember that one, but if you remember it, you know, leave it in the comments. But it's also fine, brittle hair. Now, this guy, he's playing basketball, but he's so skinny. Um, his shirt should say, love of the game. But all you can see is part of his shirt. The rest of it's wrapped around him. I mean, he's so skinny. And, he, you know, his whole body's trembling because he needs to go to the restroom. And, you know, he's playing basketball outside in the sun. So, again, if this helped out, uh, please click the like button, leave a comment, subscribe. And if you end up having something that's kind of difficult to remember, just make a dumb story. And this, my stories are pretty dumb, but, I mean, you'll remember them. You know, hypo, the donut, the sofa, the fat so, hyper, it's kind of easy. Uh, just somebody who's hyper, you know, so they're always running around. So, again, if these videos help out, please, you know, let me know. Click the like button. Share it with your friends. Uh, it really, you know, helps out. Thank you so much, guys. I, I greatly appreciate it.